Hello everyone in this Chatelaine. Good day everyone. This is Lorraine Chatelaine Makes. And this is a yarn haul take two because I already recorded it, but I can't find it to uh, the file to edit. So here we go again. So I went two places today, um, this morning. I did a thrift shop or a thrift store in town. And I also did Michael's. So, if there's any crinkling, I apologize. So, the thrift store, I paid just under $30. And this is what I got. So, this is white buffalo yarn. This was originally from the Bay. And so, it was purchased from the Bay uh, way back when because it was... Uh, the price tag is at $3.95. So, um, this is a Canadian yarn, a six strand, um, and eight ounces. And this is what it is here. Okay. So, I got three packs, so I got a pound and a half for $9.00. Awesome deal. Okay, then I got, now I have one package of yarn that I can't show you because that is for a secret project. Then I got, this bag was $5. And it has six balls of sheep cheese, sheep cheese of Buloma. And it is, excuse my glasses here so I can see. Uh, 85 acrylic and 15% kid mohair. And it just gives a color number. Uh, recommended hook and needle size are 4 millimeters. And this was made in Holland. And it, you can machine wash. I would say machine wash on gentle or hand dry. Or hand dry, hand, hand wash and lay flat to dry. Okay, no chlorine bleach and no iron. And the gauge using the four millimeters for knitting is 22 stitches equals four inches. So there it is. Now this is a lighter than what it's showing. It is more like a light emerald or green teal so i got that and oh okay i also got another bag here this was the 10.99 bag so i i this last time but i did not get it and uh the other bags that i seen there were totally gone so this is by laguna um, for um, Hayfield Textiles in England. So it's a new concept in mohair luxury. This is a deep purple and a recommended hook and needle size is 5 millimeter or US 8. And it is, I said it was made in England, hand wash only in warm water. A warm rinse. Uh, then it says hand hot final rinse and dry flat. Do not press. Brush when dry and on completion of garment. Hmm. So it is 51% mohair, 37.5% nylon and 11.5% acrylic. So I got the dark, the deep purple, and then I got this plum color, color like plum, mauve, I'd say it was mauve. Okay, so that's what I got in those. Then, now last Friday, I went to visit with my friend. She lives up the other end of the city. And um, I hadn't seen her since before COVID. 
So just was with our schedules, um, not driving and she was away, I was away. So we finally got together. I'd asked her how to make something for me. Now this was, is her own pattern. She'd been use, using for over 40 years. Now I have to keep this a secret so I cannot say what or um, show you. So I haven't started it yet, but I did need Fentex there to go with it. So I picked up a bunch and I paid um, just under $24 for 10. And I got Denim Heather. This is what it looks like. I'll read the specs after. I got Sorry on this one uh, ultra navy so it's just more black there but it is navy and i got uh hotline i like that one i got cream I got Clipso, which is a dark, uh, medium purple. This is brown with milk chocolate. Burgundy. And another Heather one. This is Black Heather. It is gray, more gray in it than just black. I got a red, which was Matador. And this one is Hot Pink. Showing up softer than what it is. Okay. So. Now this is Slipper and Craft Yarn. Uh, 3 ounces, 85 grams, 100% Oleon Exelon. Uh, long wearing, stain resistant, non-fading fast colors. Will not scratch or shrink. And it keeps the shape that you knitted it. In. and it has a new softer feel to it um, made in Canada and this is the Fentex and that is the name the brand name so it's a bulky five uh, recommended book and needle size is 5.5 machine washable in lukewarm water and you can dry no bleach no iron okay so that's that so that was my haul to show you what i got and i hope everyone's having a good day and until next time this is lorraine chatelaine makes oh by the way i do have a, a another video or two i have to find that i know i did but I need to find it and do the editing and then I'll get it uploaded. But um, sorry for the long uh, absence on videos, but um, I am working still. So trying to get everything done in, you know, juggle. So um, until next time, this is Lynn Shadley Make saying, don't forget to stop and smell the coffee and flowers. Bye for now.